Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a safe week. And we need lots of prayers and a lot of white light down in Tampa St. Pete, folks, because this thing is barreling in right now. And we're just watching it closely because we got the, the whole, all the cities are shutting down. We've been working to get everything safe. That's the bottom line. Don't make assumptions. Ask for what you want. Find the courage to ask for what you want. Others have the right to tell you yes or no, but you always have the right to ask. Likewise, everyone has the right to ask you for what they want, and you have the right to say yes or no. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading down 248. Nasdaq's up six. S&P's down 25. Gold contract down $19.70, trading at 1635 an ounce. We have silver down 45 cents, 18 dollars 45 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck ninety-five, seventy-six dollars eighty cents a barrel. Notes and bonds—they are thundering down, and the interest rates are thundering up, folks. You got the ten-year down one point plus nine ticks at one eleven ten. The thirty-year off two points plus nine ticks at one twenty-six sixteen, and the ten-year is a. Uh, Yielding 3.876. So check this out, man. This is pretty wild. Put this up here for a second. I just want to show you this because this is, you talk about an expansion, man. So let's see. So I'm going to just put this on six months. Now I guess I got to put it on a year. I'll put it on a year. So we've gone from 1.3 to 3.8 in a year. And we're not done, man. That's the real bottom line. King Dollar, and King Dollar is not done yet either. That's up 858 ticks, trading 114.05. The euro is at 96. The yen's at 144, and the British pound is at 106 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. I know what's going on in your world. And the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, the bottom line, folks, is that you're in an ABC structure down. And, you know, I always pay attention to ABCs, and bottom line is I just felt that we're getting close to that bottom. It, it's, listen, it's confirmed ABC down. That's the bottom line. We've been in an ABC down market on a continual basis. It's been kind of a field day for traders, really. Uh, but this is another ABC down, man. You broke the B point. Uh, we broke it with volume. So in the SPY, the SPY is trading 366, where A to B equals C to D is 358. The swing low there is 362. So that's telling me we're going to break the swing low. That's on the SPY. On the NDX 100, same type of setup. You broke the B, you broke it with volume, bottom line. And what's happening here with the, to the Qs and the NDX, it's actually setting up another one. You know, the way it's set up right now, the Qs are set up to go to 268. The last low out there is 269. Let me see what this one would set up. This one would be 393, oh, 394, really. So you get 72, we got 22, that'd be into 59, 259, 258. Yeah, this thing, well, we'll stay with the first one, but the bottom line, you get the gist of it. Now, let's go to King Dollar, because King Dollar, its swing point is 121. And this is moving fast and furious. You know, you get, you get the Bank of England, you know, claiming that, uh, well, the whole world's waiting for the Bank of England to do something, folks, and they're not doing anything, okay? So the pound, uh, I'll show you the pound in a second, okay? You're talking about a breakdown of the pound, pretty amazing. So if we look at the dollar here, you can see we're at 114. Um, <laughs> bottom line, the swing point is 120. The first swing point is 120.51. The high of this range is 121. That's telling me, you know what, man? We're going to go there. If you look at it intraday, you know, it's teasing folks, okay? Intraday, you can see what happened is that we hit a price point first of 114.527, then bang, and it goes all the way down. What that was about is that, and bring up the British pound, what that was about is that the market in general, you know, thought that the Bank of England would come in and save the British pound. And, you know, the bottom line, you can see what happened. I think it was just 240 last night at our time. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock our time, you can see the, the pound just about crashed. The pound got to 103. Right now, you're at 106. Um, let's bring this back because it looks to me that the euro actually is going to go to 80. 
My real question is, look at this pound, man. So the pound did 105. Look at this, man. So picture this, folks. The pound broke its low of 1985. Man, if you live overseas right now, you've lost some big wealth, man. Look, look at this. Just from 2007, the pound has got cut in half. In half. In half. That's just amazing. Now, let's go take a look at the gold contract. See what we got going here with, with gold. Because the bottom line, you know, you, you get the, the dollar going all the way up there. It's, gold's not done yet in the way down. So right now, you're, you're down with 203,000 contracts. Let me put this on a generic so we can see what is the next deal down here. Okay, so I'm putting gold up on a continuous. Yeah, fifteen fifty nine is game. Fifteen fifteen is you can see what happened. We broke this whole consolidation. You know, you come into how we came off strength in twenty nineteen. Um yeah. That's that's where this thing is looking like it wants to go, man. So, you know, there's there's a lot more downside in this whole area. And, um, you know, when we go take a look at the the euro, the euro, it looks to me that the next stop, all of these, they're going to go to the swing highs and the swing lows. And, and the swing low in the euro is 87, I believe. Eighty-two. Eighty-two. And you can see the same bill. I mean, the bottom line is, it, is it going to turn around in the middle of going up down the stairs? I don't think so, man. So that says there's a lot more pain uh, that's coming out here. And that dollar is a monster. There's no doubt about that. Dow Industrials down 232. NASDAQ is uh, flat. S&P is uh, down 23. Come right back.